Hello everyone. Inventory monthly report app helps user to generate a monthly report of the product and product categories as well. User can print and stock in and out report on the monthly basis. User have an option to select an year, start and end month, company, warehouse and type of the report and based on that selection inventory monthly report should be printed in the PDF and Excel as file format. Now let's see how it actually works. So for that we need to get into an inventory under reporting we can see an option named inventory monthly report let's get into that once you click on that it will open an wizard so from here user can select an year start month and end month and company warehouse and type of the report the type of the report may be in product and product category now let's select for the product and by clicking on the add a line we can add a product okay for which product we need end report so for that i am going to add these two product okay now there is in two options like we can print and pdf report and also we can print an excel report now let's use an pdf report so here you can see for this product for this month you can see an in and out report okay and like the same way you can change an end month also and start month and like the same way let's do the same for product category now here you can add and product categories okay for that i have added the category so let's add an one more category like consumable okay now let's print the pdf report now uh, you can see that it will be print based on the product category wise okay and here you can see the in and out of that particular products now like the same way let's print an xls report here we can download the xls file so here you can see the inventory monthly report of based on the product category wise will be printed on that xls report and here you can see the overall report of each and every product in this category in this way we can make use of this module to help users to generate a monthly report of the product and product categories as well if you have any queries regarding this video you can ask in the comment box we will definitely solve your queries and if you feel this video is helpful to you you can like this video and subscribe our youtube channel for more odoo related updates to see more about an inventory related module check our browse info playlist to see all newly updated inventory features that we have thanks for watching